Welcome back to The Division 2. In this video I want to talk to you about how you can get the exotic assault rifle, the Chameleon. Bear in mind this is not the guaranteed way to obtain the weapon, it's just speculation based on me doing some research and following some of the patterns the game has with its looting system. And before we jump into it, if you've enjoyed The Division 2 and want to be kept in the loop about new things in the game and how development is progressing, then make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on bell notifications to be alerted when I upload. So, the new exotic weapon, the Chameleon Assault Rifle, will be coming into the game with Episode 3 and Title Update 7, which I'm guessing will be releasing on the 18th for Year 1 Pass owners and the following week, the 25th, for Players Without the Pass. But we don't actually have a set date yet, we have the live stream coming up today for the teaser of what's coming to The Division 2, like the future of the game, and then tomorrow we will have State of the Game, Hopefully because they haven't confirmed anything yet and we should find out more info then. The developers won't tell us exactly how to get the chameleon, they actually want us to go digging and find it for ourselves. So I have been watching videos on the same topic and I've done some thinking. Most exotics in the game follow the same pattern of relating to the description of that piece of gear. Using the Nemesis as an example, there's a piece of writing from Puck. Puck is the first boss you can find in the main mission, Grand Washington Hotel. Thinking back to the Nemesis, it wasn't as easy as killing Puck. You had to wait for invasions to find pieces of the Nemesis, and then after obtaining them all, you would be able to take down Puck and get the missing piece in order to craft the Nemesis Sniper. Now, taking a look at the Chameleon, the description for the gun, reads the chameleon is coated in a light refracting technology designed by a darpa research team and with the description mentioning a darpa research team it could more than likely mean that either taking down brenner or waiting for the darpa research labs to go invaded and taking down that boss is our only way to obtain this weapon but i don't think they're going to make it that simple the nemesis was gated behind a few weeks of playing invaded missions to get hold of all the parts needed to craft it and they don't want the weapon to be too easy to get hold of, or people will just get the weapon and be done with it. They're going to probably do something to entice people to keep playing, because the other content in episode 3, more than likely, will not keep you playing for longer than a few hours, maybe a whole day, if you're trying out absolutely everything in depth. So they're going to want to keep the players active on the game, and the only way to do that might be to add in some other puzzles to solve in order to get the chameleon, but that's going to do it for the video. Let me know your thoughts and stuff in the comments. I hope you enjoyed it. I really hope this speculation leads to be the, like the spot on accurate right way to get the gun. Thank you for watching.